Gretchen Carlson is a Miss America pageant winner, a TV personality, and now an author. She is launching her new book, Getting Real, by Gretchen Carlson here at the First Presbyterian Church in Greenwich. I for sure wanted to launch my book in Greenwich because this is my home now. I have lived here almost longer than I lived in Minnesota where I grew up, which is saying a lot because I've lived all over the country. And I especially wanted to launch it at my church because religion has been my foundation. Carlson was born in Minnesota and is the granddaughter of a Lutheran minister. She began playing the violin at a very young age. And it just clicked early on and I was a really serious violinist until I was about 17. And then I went to my parents and said, I'm burned out and I want to try something else. And they were kind of devastated with that. But I really wanted to concentrate on my academics. So I went off to Stanford and studied there. And then my mom got a brochure in the mail on the Miss America pageant. And she called me up and she said, I think I found something for you to use your violin talent. And I said, what? And she said, the Miss America pageant, it's 50% of your points. And I said, mom, no way. <laughs> I mean, I grew up a chubby kid, a tomboy. I really was not into pageants at all, but she convinced me. And then once I decided to do it like anything else in life, I just decided to give it my all. And that mindset of success is what her book is all about. I wanted to write the book because I want to inspire young and old that the American dream is still alive. And that if you work hard and you persevere, that you too can reach you know, your, your goals and your accomplishments. But Carlson says she also writes about failure in the book. And I think that that's a really important ingredient in success. And it makes you appreciate success that much more. I'm a real person too, and relatable. I've been fired. I have great empathy for people who are out of work. I had infertility problems. My first child was born with a tumor in her eye. I grew up a chubby kid. I was taunted and teased. So I want people to be able to relate to me and say to themselves, well, wow, if she persevered, then I can as well. And when asked about book number two. This is my inspirational memoir. So maybe a different kind of a book down, down the road. But as I say in the book, you're never too old to take on new accomplishments and new goals. And so no matter how old I am, I always want to learn something new. So who knows, maybe politics, maybe go back to actually get that law degree. It just remains kind of a question mark. The host of The Real Story with Gretchen Carlson will embark on an 18-city book tour after Monday night's launch that featured a question and answer with Kathy Lee Gifford. Reporting for the Greenwich Sentinel, I'm Taylor Knight.